You're watching Flow Working, the entrepreneur's podcast. I'm your host, Megan Anderson. More people than ever are starting the entrepreneur journey and learning a lot in the process. On this show, I sit down with regular people who are running all types of businesses to discuss the ideas, opportunities, and strategies they're using to build, grow, and thrive as an entrepreneur. Before we get started, make sure you tap the button and subscribe to the channel. Then hit like and share your favorite videos with others. Okay, now on with the show. You will start seeing that everything within your business will completely shift. Mm -hmm. And then what you need to be also doing is that, first of all, understand who you are. That's usually the biggest challenge there. Like, who am I actually deep, deep down? What are my my core values? What do I believe in? What do I stand for? What gets me excited? And and what sort of impact I actually want to make in this world while while I'm around? If you know the answers, or at least some of the answers to that, look at ways how can i actually make sure i can actually make sure that i'm serving these values with my business or with my products Mm -hmm. or with the audience that i'm serving so in my case it was quite an obvious route that i have a business background and a marketing background Mm -hmm. so i could just move that onto a community that really needs that kind of support and because they they're not being taught how to become entrepreneurs or how to market themselves and how to sell like Selling is a big, scary monster out there within this community as well. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, these things happen. So a couple of small examples maybe to, to give some, uh, some people who are running their businesses and they're like, I can't be spiritual in my business. Yeah. Yes, you can. You can start with becoming mindful in your business decisions. So before you are making a, a new decision about your next business development or before you start targeting a new audience, just mm-hmm. really tune into your actual real self and ask yourself, do I want this? And yes, why do I want this? If I do this, what impact is it going to, to create within the business or with my community? How is my business makes the world a little bit better than it was yesterday? These are simple, simple questions, simple enough, I would say. (laughs) (laughs) But once we start shifting our mindset about how we do business and how Mm -hmm. we run businesses and how we treat even our employees or our customers, you can realize that spirituality and business, actually, they do not sit so far away from each other. What's a great way for people to get connected with you right now? The easiest way is just to go to my website, which is Connect One Marketing, because we are all one and we're all connected. So that's why it's connectonemarketing.com. And they can find Thank you for watching this episode of Flow Working, the Entrepreneur's Podcast. Please make sure to subscribe to the channel. And while you're here, watch another episode for more advice about being a successful entrepreneur.